I'm from Faculty Analytic Engineering. I'm the first members or the first group of D1. So, I'll continue to the second members. Uh, hi, uh, my name is Mohd Faris Bia uh, I'm from Faculty uh, Electrical Engineering. Uh, and uh, I'm the second members in this group. Hi, my name is Mohd Adelian Bintoroni. I am from Faculty of Electrical Engineering and I am the third members of this group. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Hadi bin Aizuraimi. I'm from Faculty Electric Electronic and I'm a fourth member in this group. Now, let's go to continue our first question, which is what we have learned from this activity. Let's so, let's continue with the first question, which is what we have learned when we are doing this activity. So, there is four things that we are learned from this activity which is first one is teamwork second one is uh, communication third one is leadership and last one is problem solving so the first one teamwork we are learning how to work effectively and we can uh, we need to how to manage our time properly so let's move to the second one which is um, communication how we communicate with each other we communicate each other by sharing our ideas together and listen to our our opinion, our members' opinion. So that's how we learn how to communicate with each other. So the third one, the third one is leadership. Me as a leader of the group, firstly I will I will identify the task and make sure all the group members were ready to doing the task right the time, right on the time. So I will I will assign the task to the group my to my group members and make sure they complete all the task directly and complete right the time. So, um, last one is problem solving. So when we are doing this bridge, there is a lot of problem when we are doing uh, when we are doing this. So how we settle how we settle the problem? We settle the problem by using our knowledge, our skill, and that's how we settle our problem. So, there is the fourth one that we are learning, which is problem solving. So, that's all for me. Watch out! Okay, so let's talk about the second question. After we uh, finish uh, doing this project, I think the biggest uh, challenge uh, while doing this uh, mini bridge is we had to ensure the integrity and uh, safety structure uh, because after the uh, product is done uh, we need to test using uh, 5 kg weights okay so uh, all of group members and also me uh, decide uh, to use uh, a simple and good materials such as uh, we use, uh, we choose uh, to use uh, old newspaper and uh, sellotape. Uh, we also provide from uh, the lecturer to use only ten pieces, uh, ten piece of uh, newspaper. Okay. So if you can see, while doing this uh, project, we uh, ensure the, the uh, we ensure the all part in this mini bridge uh, wrap uh, with. Uh, a lot of selective to make sure its uh, dur durability is good durability is good so uh, the second challenge uh, is uh, we need to present this mini bridge in uh, perfect design uh, given time only one hour to interest the lecturer okay. all of member groups and also me uh, decide to uh, Combine uh, existing design and our own design. So this is the look for the product after done. Okay. So uh, let's go to the next question uh, about uh, uh, how to. Eh, what is the solving? Uh, what is the strategies to solving the task? Okay. So let's go. 
now that I move into our next question which is what strategies does I will use in order to complete this amazing bridge the first thing we do is we discuss together and create a rough drawing of this bridge after finish the drawing we divided our group into two partners what the first partner need to do is they will fold and flip the newspaper in order to create this body and the leg of the bridge after that the second partner will use tape to put all the pieces together and create this amazing bridge after that we use a lot of tape to <coughs> we, we use a lot of tape to wrap this body and the leg to make this bridge more stable and more strong now let me show you a video uh, of our bridge after we put 5 kg weight in our bridge to prove how strong our bridge is. <laughs> Eh jangan lah hujung-hujung sangat tu. Tengah lah dikit, tengah lah dikit. Jangan main tipu. As you seen how strong our bridge right after we satisfied with our with the strength of our bridge we roll a, a piece of newspaper and use a piece of tape to create this beautiful hole and put it in our bridge to make our bridge more elegant and more beautiful i think that's all from me thank you okay the last question is the way we do our strategy to make this bridge first we are going to planning start by understanding the train considering the lot requirements and defining the bridge purpose second materials select selection um, choose the appropriate materials um, based on the factor like strength durability and cost. Third, about design. Develop a solid design. Um, cons develop a solid design considering the considering the um, considering the bridge, the bridge stability, supports, and lot distribution. Fourth about execution follow the plan precisely during construction and lastly we are going to um, testing um, evaluate evaluate the evaluate the stability and strength before through through testing before actual use okay by combining them we can get the comprehensive and engaging the brick challenge. That's all from me. Thank you.